Don't go away. Dinosaurs will be right back. Tonight on Magical World of Disney. Stuff yourself with three stocking stuffers. Excellent. First, we've got the stuffed and stuffing dreams are made up with the classic Mr. Magoo's Christmas Carol. You know, sort of a gift of Christmas past, you might say. <laughs> yes. Then it's a gift of Christmas future. Our own state-of-the-art computer animated movie, Toy Story. This is great. Finally, the Christmas lights are on, but nobody's home. And Ernest saves Christmas. Our gift of Christmas present. In fact, come to think of it, the whole night is a Christmas present. Tonight on Magical World of Disney. Movies at 7, 6 Central. Hey. I'm April V, outside one of Disney's recording studios, where some of the most famous Disney characters get a voice. Inside, they're working on a new movie called Beauty and the Beast, The Enchanted Christmas. It's a story about the Beauty and the Beast characters celebrating a magical Christmas. Let's meet the real-life voice of Belle, Paige O'Hara. Well, what exactly do you do in here? Well, I go through my script, I make my choices, and in animation, they actually put the voices down first, and the animators will videotape us sometimes, but they actually draw the characters after we do the voices. But today, it's a little different. We're looping. What's looping? I have to match Belle's image here on the screen. I have to do the voice, and it's going to have to match her exactly. Greg, roll it. Okay. What's Christmas? Oh, Chip, you must know about Christmas. Stockings in front of the fire, tree, tinsel. Wow, can I try? Sure. Bell, what's Christmas? Oh, Chip, you must know about Christmas. Stockings in front of the fire, tree, tinsel, presents. Presents? <laughs> what? You were perfect. Uh, thanks. <laughs> that was fun. Isn't it fun? Coming out on video only this holiday season. Don't miss Paige O'Hara as the voice of Belle. Absolutely. In a brand new movie, Beauty and the Beast, The Enchanted Christmas. We now return to dinosaurs, right here on Disney. <laughs> Don't go away. Dinosaurs will be right back. Leonardo, Leonardo, wherefore art thou DiCaprio? With the Seavers? God, I love those guys. Believe it or not, long before he was breaking hearts in Romeo and Juliet and Titanic, Leonardo DiCaprio was breaking in on growing pains. Of course, after only a couple of weeks, it was growing painfully obvious that he was having growing pains of his own. Excuse me! Movie star Leonardo DiCaprio, you'll be able to say you knew him when. When? Every night on Growing Pains for the next two weeks. Today at 5.30 p.m., 4.30 Central on Disney. Monday on Magical World of Disney. Two shows with Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer. I can't believe it! What I can't believe is why they call him a reindeer. It's not like he's a deer of the rain. If anything, he should be a snow deer, right? Like in Rudolph's Shiny New Year. Stop this tyranny at once! No, I'm serious. Why a reindeer? Unless it's because he's at the end of Santa's reigns. Like in Rudolph and Frosty Christmas in July. Oh, come on. He's such a cute one, isn't he? Hey, that must be where they get the second part of reindeer. You know, because he's so dear. Oh, dear. Monday on Disney. Movies at 7, 6 Central. Muppets Tonight is now on Disney. I love the Muppets. With never-before-seen episodes. Look, no hands! No hands! And so much star power, it'll blow you away. Let's show them what we got. Catch all the excitement on... Muppets Tonight! Tonight at 6.30 p.m., 5.30 Central. <laughs> Unbelievable. Only on Disney. Welcome to Magical World of Animals. Would you like to try our creature combo on Sunday nights, going well with Jeff Carwin and Umba Macamba? I will set aside my hunger and focus on what I do best, giving animal information to the world. Well, in that case, first whet your appetite for the wild with a supersized serving of Jeff Carwin. I think I need some cocktail sauce, though. Then, still hungry for more? Pig out with Macamba. I'm going to starve. Hold the pickles, hold the lettuce. Just don't hold this. Only joking. You'll eat it up tomorrow at 7 p.m., 6 Central. This is delicious. We now return to dinosaurs, right here on Disney. What's better than one holiday gift? Two. Coming up next, watch back-to-back -back episodes of Growing Pains. It's all coming up right here on Disney. Tonight on Magical World of Disney. Stuff yourself with three stocking stuffers. Excellent. First, we've got the stuffed and stuffing dreams are made up with the classic Mr. Magoo's Christmas Carol. 
you know, sort of a gift of Christmas past, you might say. Yes. Then it's a gift of Christmas future. Our own state-of-the-art computer animated movie, Toy Story. This is great. Finally, the Christmas lights are on, but nobody's home. And Ernest saves Christmas. Our gift of Christmas present. In fact, come to think of it, the whole night is a Christmas present. Tonight on Magical World of Disney. Movies at 7, 6 Central. Hey. Here's a special holiday greeting from Disney. How do you celebrate the holidays? We're, we're the, the Finleys. Finleys. And, and we're the Kellys. Kellys. And, and we, we have, have double the fun for the holidays. We always make latkes on Hanukkah. They are potato pancakes with applesauce. Every year my mom makes our Christmas cards. She uses these stamps. And this is how I make the card. Happy, Happy Holidays from Disney! Hey, movie surfers, it's Tina. Today we're peeking behind the scenes of Disney's new comedy, Mr. Magoo, based on the famous cartoon character. Magoo? I love that cartoon. Who's playing him? Leslie Nielsen. In the movie, he witnesses the world's worst jewel heist and ends up with a priceless ruby. <laughs> Was it tough turning the cartoon into live action? To find out how they transformed Mr. Magoo, click the focus on icon. I want you to put some water on the boil and lift both legs high into the air. Magoo is a very happy man, and uh, he would prefer to find some way to laugh and to be generous and jovial than to be uh, serious and desperate. So I find it's easier to pep it up and say, ah, <laughs> no, well, yes. Just like the cartoon, Mr. Magoo finds himself in some close calls. To the eggplant mobile. I thought it would be funny to have Magoo get involved in some dire daredevil stunt stuff. I'm skiing down the mountain on the inverted ironing board. <laughs> but the whole production has unusual action sequences. So that's our focus on Mr. Magoo, coming to theaters December 25th. Yes! <laughs> Leonardo, Leonardo, where for art thou, DiCaprio? With the Seavers? God, I love those guys. Believe it or not, long before he was breaking hearts in Romeo and Juliet and Titanic, Leonardo DiCaprio was breaking in on growing pains. Of course, after only a couple of weeks, it was growing painfully obvious that he was having growing pains of his own. Excuse me! Movie star Leonardo DiCaprio. You'll be able to say you knew him when. When? Every night on Growing Pains for the next two weeks. Coming up next on Disney. Happy Hanukkah from Disney. Happy Kwanzaa from Disney. Merry Christmas from Disney. No matter how you celebrate the season, happy holidays. Stay tuned. Growing Pains will be right back. Weekend afternoon movies are Disney distractions tomorrow. Mickey and the gang are going to teach you how to keep your Christmas tree happy this holiday season. Wow! Now take pride in your tree. Everyone join in and decorate. Remember, a happy tree is a festive tree, so talk to it. <laughs> Nourish your tree with lots and lots of presents. And don't forget to check for freshness. After all, uh, it is Christmas. Watch a Disney Channel Christmas with your happy tree. Tomorrow at 325, 225 Central on Disney. Tomorrow at 6.30, 5.30 Central on a never-before-seen Muppets Tonight. What would you expect from a greatest hit show? Big stars, unforgettable performances. She switches the brights up. We share my And, of course, plenty of hits. Muppets Tonight's Greatest Hits, tomorrow at 6.30, 5.30 Central on Disney. That was surprisingly good. Come on, everybody, you gotta watch us now. Oh, the sea just breaking now. Wanna see action? Something for everyone. Wanna share the magic? So come on, join the party. On Disney, yeah. It's a world of imagination. Disney, it's a magic celebration. Tuesday on Magical World of Disney. 
We've got three holiday shows asking, what's that special thing you're wishing for? I don't know. Well, how about a plush toy animal? You even get to name it yourself. This is Velma the Magnificent. Well, whether you wish for something that speeds by, flies away, or maybe as a surprise, remember who can make it all happen. First, there's... Santa Claus. And then there's Disney, making your holiday wishes come true with the Teddy Bear's Christmas. The bestest present? And it nearly wasn't Christmas. Tuesday on Disney, movies at 7, 6 central. We now return to Growing Pains, right here on Disney. Bye. Stay tuned. Growing Pains will be right back. Now, Muppets Tonight is part of the magic right here on Disney. <laughs> where, 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 where'd Gonzo go? I'm here on Disney with Muppets Tonight. Wow, look at the view. Muppets Tonight, tonight at 6.30, 5.30 Central, only on Disney. Hi, I'm Rockball Rojas reporting for Disney near Glacier National Park. And behind me, they're taping an episode of Going Wild with Jeff Corin. Let's go check it out. Hey, how you doing, Raphael? This gorgeous creature right here is a Canadian lynx. And just like a bobcat, it has a bobtail, pointy ears, and these giant pad-like paws it uses to take down its prey. Wow, so this is your job? Hang out with animals all day? Well, you know what? Ever since I was your age, I loved creatures. And now I get to study them firsthand because I'm an ecologist, which is someone who studies animals and the environment they live in. In fact, we're studying lynx and porcupines. And right over there, I heard there was one hanging out in a tree. Would you like to try to find it? Cool, let's go. I actually saw you eat termites on your show. Uh -huh. How'd you get the nerve to do that? Well, Raphael, that was in Belize. And I ate the termites to show people that they're actually a good form of protein. Need some ketchup. I saw you hold a tarantula once on your show. Didn't that gross you out? It didn't gross me out at all because tarantulas are just another living thing, just like a squirrel or a bird. By the way, Jeff's a trained animal expert. So leave the animal handling to him. Did you hear that? Right up there. Come here. And there it is, the creature we've been looking for. It's a young porcupine. And like all mammals, it's covered with fur or hair. But unlike other different types, this hair has been modified into sharp quills for stabbing predators. Looks like you got some quills up there. <laughs> Thanks, Jeff. I learned a lot. Next time I'll see you, it'll be on your show. Going Wild with Jeff Corin. Tomorrow night at 7 6 Central on Disney. We now return to Growing Pains, right here on Disney. Coming up next, it's Growing Pains. Then, if you like your Muppets shaken, not stirred, watch Muppets Tonight with special guest star Pierce Brosnan. Happy Holidays from Disney. Disney's got a show that shows you about brotherly love. Oh, look at that! Brothers should get together for quiet dinners at home. Brothers should help out around the house. Look at that, it's messy again. Hold up. Oh my gosh, it's clean. Brothers should find activities to do together. You have me cleaning the shower on Saturday morning. Fungus doesn't sleep in on weekends, Joe. Or weekdays either, for that matter, because the brothers are on brotherly love. We're here to have fun. Every weekday at 6, 35, 30 Central, only on Disney. Want to check out Disney Channel online? It's easy. Just go to www.disney.com. See Mickey and the Kids Square? Click there to get to the next screen where you'll hit the Disney Channel panel and voila, you're in. Now you know how to check out all the cool stuff happening on our website. Here's a special holiday greeting from Disney. Silent night. Oh. to string popcorn and sing at Christmas time.
magical world of Disney. Two shows with Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer. I can't believe it! What I can't believe is why they call him a reindeer. It's not like he's a deer of the rain. If anything, he should be a snow deer, right? Like in Rudolph's Shiny New Year. Stop this tyranny at once! No, I'm serious. Why a reindeer? Unless it's because he's at the end of Santa's reigns, like in Rudolph and Frosty Christmas in July. Oh, come on. He's such a cute one, isn't he? Hey, that must be where they get the second part of Reindeer. You know, because he's so dear. Oh, dear. Monday on Disney. Movies at 7, 6 Central. No matter how you celebrate the season, may your days be merry and bright. Happy Holidays from Disney. Stay tuned. Growing Pains will be right back. Weekend afternoon movies are Disney distractions tomorrow. Mickey and the gang are going to teach you how to keep your Christmas tree happy this holiday season. Wow! Now take pride in your tree. Everyone join in and decorate. Remember, a happy tree is a festive tree, so talk to it. <laughs> Nourish your tree with lots and lots of presents. And don't forget to check for freshness. After all, uh, it is Christmas. Watch a Disney Channel Christmas with your happy tree. Tomorrow at 325, 225 Central on Disney. And now a few words from Disney. Laugh. Explore. Sing. Play. Dance. You're a dancing fool, man. What I'm talking? Look at that. Perform. Question. Uh, rap? Experience. Let's go surfing. Okay, now try it at home. Laugh. Explore. Sing. Play. Dance. On Disney. Want to spend some time with a typical American family? Meet the Sinclairs every afternoon on Disney. Okay, so they're dinosaurs. That doesn't stop me from having a flagrantly uninformed opinion. But Dad still goes to work each day. Sinclair, in here now! Mom watches the baby. I can do it! I can do it! You just never know what to expect with this family. Your folks never have mammals over for dinner? All the time! They're yummy! So if you're hungry for more, watch Dinosaurs every day at 5 p.m. 4 Central on Disney. Sunday nights, Magical World of Disney becomes Disney's Magical World of Animals. And if you don't believe me, Umba Macumba. Is that Swahili for Ask Macumba? It's also the name of a show. Do not be confused by its name. This know-it-all really does know it all, at least when it comes to animals. Macumba never tires of unlocking the vaults of wisdom and sharing his intellectual riches with the world. Go inside the mind of Africa's Animal Answer Man and also get to see some really cool animals do some really cool stuff. Be there tomorrow at 7 30, 6 30 Central on Disney. Thank you for calling. We now return to Growing Pains, right here on Disney. Stay tuned. Growing Pains will be right back. Tonight on Magical World of Disney, stuff yourself with three stocking stuffers. Excellent. First, we've got the stuff and stuffing dreams are made up with the classic Mr. Magoo's Christmas Carol. You know, sort of a gift of Christmas past, you might say. Yes. Then it's a gift of Christmas future. Our own state-of-the-art computer animated movie, Toy Story. This is great! Finally, the Christmas lights are on, but nobody's home. And Ernest saves Christmas. Our gift of Christmas present. In fact, come to think of it, the whole night is a Christmas present. Tonight on Magical World of Disney. Movies at 7, 6 Central. Hey. Disney presents 60 Seconds of Science with Bill Nye, the Science Guy. That poster and these toys are glowing. So are the minerals in these rocks. They glow under black light. And you say, light that's black? Well, it's not black, but it is light. Oh. Ultraviolet light. Now, ultraviolet means slightly above violet, slightly above purple. We call it ultraviolet light because it's just past the light that we can see with our eyes. There's a little more energy than the violet that we can see. We don't see ultraviolet light till it bounces off of something that glows. We say the pigments in the toys cool. and the minerals in these rocks are fluorescent. They fluoresce. By the way, fluorescent lights, like you might have in your school or at home, are really ultraviolet lights with fluorescent paint on the inside of the glass. Isn't that cool? Because these things really glow, don't they? Okay, time's up. See you next time on Disney's 60 Seconds of Science. Sunday night's magical world of Disney becomes Disney's magical world of animals. And one such animal is so rare it can only be seen on Disney. 
We're talking about a mammal known as a Jeff Corwin. Its scientific name is Ambistoma tigranum. This Corwin creature habitats a Disney Channel environment called Going Wild with Jeff Corwin. Every week, he goes wild into the wild, seeking to find and understand other animals. There's something right there moving around. Join an actual Jeff Corwin on his daring journeys tomorrow at 7, 6 Central on Disney. We now return to Growing Pains, right here on Disney. The doc. Tonight on Disney, if you'd like your Muppets shaken, not stirred, watch Pierce Brosnan on Muppets Tonight. Then, get in the holiday spirit with Mr. Magoo's Christmas Carol. Later, it's Disney's first fully computer animated feature, Toy Story. It's all coming up tonight, right here on Disney. And now it's time for a Toy Story treat. Toy Story, tonight at 8, 7 Central on Disney. Hey guys, it's Matt from the Movie Surfers here on Disney. Guess what? Tina went to the premiere of the new Disney comedy Flubber starring Robin Williams. Why don't we take a snapshot look at the big event? Tom, click the icon. Surfers, can you believe it? This is such a scene. Green carpet, test tubes, tons of fans. And look at these lights. And of course, Robin Williams. Robin's making too much noise over there! Please! So I understand that you had to mime and act like you had flubber in your hands. How did you do that? You basically have to create this character and, you know, give it depth and height. And then along with that, give it a personality. Describe it. And that's how you create it. What was it like bouncing around on the set? Fun. You have to do. Well, basically, you get to fly as bungee cords and you wear this incredibly tight pants. Well, 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 what was it like working with someone like Robin Williams? You can tell what it's like working with Robin Williams. It's as unpredictable as Flubber. <laughs> After the movie, it was time for the cast and crew to celebrate. Here's my pass for the party. Let's go. They made the party look just like the gym in the movie. Pretty gross, huh? Let's try the Flubber talk. And that's our snapshot look at Flubber's premiere. You can check out Flubber yourself, now playing in theaters. See ya, surfers. We're decking the halls to wish you and your whole family the happiest of holidays. Merry Christmas from Disney. Let's go up. Don't go away. Muppets Tonight will be right back. Tonight on Magical World of Disney. Stuff yourself with three stocking stuffers. Excellent. First, we've got the stuffed and stuffing dreams are made up with the classic Mr. Magoo's Christmas Carol. You know, sort of a gift of Christmas past, you might say. <laughs> yes. Then it's a gift of Christmas future, our own state-of-the-art computer animated movie, Toy Story. This is great. Finally, the Christmas lights are on, but nobody's home, and Ernest saves Christmas, our gift of Christmas present. In fact, come to think of it, the whole night is a Christmas present. Tonight on Magical World of Disney, movies at 7, 6 Central. Hey. Disney's got a show that shows you about brotherly love. Oh, look at that! Brothers should get together for quiet dinners at home. Brothers should help out around the house. Look at that, it's messy again. Hold up. Oh my gosh, it's clean. Brothers should find activities to do together. You have me cleaning the shower on Saturday morning. Fungus doesn't sleep in on weekends, Joe. Or weekdays either, for that matter, because the brothers are on brotherly love. We're here to have fun. Every weekday at 6, 35, 30 Central, only on Disney. Come on, everybody, you gotta watch us now. We're Disney. We're the sea just breaking now. We're Disney. Wanna see action? Something for everyone. Wanna share the magic? So come on, join the party. On Disney. Yeah. It's a world of imagination. Disney. It's a magic celebration. Tuesday on Magical World of Disney. 
We've got three holiday shows asking, what's that special thing you're wishing for? I don't know. Well, how about a plush toy animal? You even get to name it yourself. This is Velma the Magnificent. Well, whether you wish for something that speeds by, flies away, or maybe as a surprise, remember who can make it all happen. First, there's... Santa Claus. And then there's Disney, making your holiday wishes come true with the Teddy Bear's Christmas. The bestest present? And it nearly wasn't Christmas. Tuesday on Disney. Movies at 7, 6 Central. And now back to Muppets Tonight, right here on Disney. Enough. Don't go away. Muppets Tonight will be right back. And now it's time for a Toy Story treat. Am I too tall for this? Be honest. Don't miss Toy Story, tonight at 8, 7 Central, on Disney. Want to spend some time with a typical American family? Meet the Sinclairs, every afternoon on Disney. Okay, so they're dinosaurs. That doesn't stop me from having a flagrantly uninformed opinion. But Dad still goes to work each day. Sinclair, in here now! Mom watches the baby. I didn't do it! I didn't do it! You just never know what to expect with this family. Your folks never have mammals over for dinner? Oh, the time! So if you're hungry for more, watch Dinosaurs every day at 5 p.m. 4 Central on Disney. Weekend afternoon movies are Disney distractions tomorrow. Mickey and the gang are going to teach you how to keep your Christmas tree happy this holiday season. Wow! Now take pride in your tree. Everyone join in and decorate. Remember, a happy tree is a festive tree, so talk to it. <laughs> Nourish your tree with lots and lots of presents. And don't forget to check for freshness. After all, <laughs> it is Christmas. Watch a Disney Channel Christmas with your happy tree. Tomorrow at 325, 225 Central on Disney. Tomorrow night, Magical World of Disney becomes Disney's Magical World of Animals. We're going wild with Jeff Corwin, followed by Umba Macomba. Tomorrow night on Disney. Here's a special holiday greeting from Disney. How do you celebrate the holidays? Every New Year's, my dad and I play football. Against my brother-in-law and his kids. They always win. We have a Hanukkah party every year. Every family brings a menorah. And then we light them. It looks very pretty. Happy holidays from Disney. And now back to Muppets Tonight, right here on Disney. Tomorrow at 6 35 30 Central on a never before seen Muppets Tonight. What would you expect from a greatest hit show? Big stars, unforgettable performances. She switches the brights up. We share on the And of course, plenty of hits. Muppets Tonight's Greatest Hits, tomorrow at 6.35, 30 Central on Disney. That was surprisingly good. Tonight on Disney, Mr. Magoo plays Scrooge in his version of a holiday classic. It's Mr. Magoo's Christmas Carol. Then two friends find out what they're really made of in Toy Story. Later, can Ernest help Santa find his holiday spirit? Find out in Ernest Saves Christmas. It's all coming up tonight, right here on Disney. Welcome to Magical World of Animals. Would you like to try our creature combo on Sunday nights, going wild with Jeff Carwin and Umba Macumba? I will set aside my hunger and focus on what I do best, giving animal information to the world. Dire daredevil stunt stuff. I'm skiing down the mountain on the inverted ironing board. <laughs> but the whole production has unusual action sequences. So that's our focus on Mr. Magoo. Coming to theaters December 25th. Yes! <laughs> Want to check out Disney Channel online? It's easy. Just go to www.disney.com. See Mickey and the Kids Square? Click there to get to the next screen where you'll hit the Disney Channel panel and voila, you're in. Now you know how to check out all the cool stuff happening on our website. We're decking the halls to wish you and your whole family the happiest of holidays. Merry Christmas from Disney. <laughs> Don't go away. Dinosaurs will be right back. 
Welcome to Magical World of Animals. Would you like to try our creature combo on Sunday nights, going well with Jeff Carwin and Umba Macamba? I will set aside my hunger and focus on what I do best, giving animal information to the world. Well, in that case, first whet your appetite for the wild with a supersized serving of Jeff Carwin. I think I need some cocktail sauce, though. Then, still hungry for more? Pig out with Macamba. I'm going to starve. Hold the pickles, hold the lettuce, just don't hold this. <laughs> Only joking. You'll eat it up tonight at 7 p.m. 6 Central. This is delicious. Tomorrow night on Magical World of Disney, two shows with Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer. I can't believe it. What I can't believe is why they call him a reindeer. It's not like he's a deer of the rain. If anything, he should be a snow deer, right? Like in Rudolph's shiny new year. Stop this tyranny at once. No, I'm serious. Why a reindeer? Unless it's because he's at the end of Santa's reigns, like in Rudolph and Frosty Christmas in July. Oh, come on. He's such a cute one, isn't he? Hey, that must be where they get the second part of reindeer. You know, because he's so dear. Oh, dear. Tomorrow night on Disney. Movies at 7, 6 Central. Disney presents 60 Seconds of Science with Bill Nye, the Science Guy. What keeps an airplane up in the air? Well, take a look at this. It's our big plastic flying plane of science. And as the air goes past the wings, it changes direction. It gets pushed down. Now, to make sure the air changes direction, we give the wing an angle of attack. By giving the wings an angle of attack, we make sure there's higher pressure underneath than on top. That's lift. Now, to make the plane go sideways, we move this part of the tail. It's called the rudder. If we push the rudder this way, the plane goes that way. If we push the rudder that way, the plane goes that way. The rudder is producing lift sideways. Now, birds steer in the same way, too, but birds usually don't steer with their tails. Birds steer with their heads and necks, like this. Oh. That is really gonna hurt. See you next time on Disney's 60 Seconds of Science. We now return to dinosaurs, right here on Disney. Don't go away. Dinosaurs will be right back. Now, Muppets Tonight is part of the magic right here on Disney. <laughs> where, where, where'd, where'd Gonzo go? I'm here on Disney with Muppets Tonight. Wow, look at the view. Muppets Tonight, tonight at 6.30, 5.30 Central, only on Disney. Everybody, I'm Rudy Lipscomb here at the Walt Disney Studios Animation Building in Burbank, California. And if you're like me, you probably draw and doodle a lot. But have you ever wondered what it would take to be a real Disney animator? Well, Disney's been doing some neat stuff lately to help kids learn how to do just that. Recently, Disney got together with Cox Communications to create a Line to Learning event that allowed over 3,000 kids from across the country to have an interactive online chat with Betsy Betos, a real animator who gave a drawing lesson and answered kids' questions about animation. Betsy, how do you start to draw? I used to sketch every day in my little sketch pad. They also got to learn how to draw Disney characters and create artwork by using a new CD-ROM called Disney's Magic Artist. I think we better check this out. Come on. This is Mark Greenberg, marketing director for Disney's Magic Artist. So, Mark, can you show us what Magic Artist can do? Sure. Disney's Magic Artist lets kids create pictures just like a Disney artist. You can draw and paint your own backgrounds and characters, use Disney magic stamps, or even watch and listen to real Disney animators. We'll show you how to draw your favorite Disney characters step by step. Wow. Can I try? Sure. Well, Rudy, let's see how you did. Well, it could happen. Just keep drawing. I know I will. We now return to Dinosaurs, right here on Disney. What's better than one holiday gift? Two. Coming up next, watch back-to-back -back episodes of Growing Pains. It's all coming up right here on Disney. 
Tomorrow night on Magical World of Disney, two shows with Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer. I can't believe it! What I can't believe is why they call him a reindeer. It's not like he's a deer of the rain. If anything, he should be a snow deer, right? Like in Rudolph's Shiny New Year. Stop this tyranny at once! No, I'm serious. Why a reindeer? Unless it's because he's at the end of Santa's reign, like in Rudolph and Frosty Christmas in July. Oh, come on. He's such a cute one, isn't he? Hey, that must be where they get the second part of Reindeer. You know, because he's so dear. Oh, dear. Tomorrow night on Disney. Movies at 7, 6 Central. Hey, folks! Feeling blocked, befuddled, confused? Well, now Disney's got the cure for what ails you. Disney's got pow, zip, bang, boom, pop, and a boss included at no extra charge. Now on Disney, you'll find young stars like cars, dynamic dinos, babies and their sitters, big brothers, magic genies, beanies, and more, much, much more. Plus, if you watch now, you'll see at no extra charge. More stuff to numerous to mention. Turn on Disney, we got the cure for what ails you. But just now, holy cow, the diamonds now on Disney! Wednesday on Magical World of Disney. Wow. Twas the night before Christmas and all through the place, every toy was stirring, even the one with a movable face. Look, I'm Picasso. The family was gathered by the tree with care in hopes that Denzel soon would be there. I'm an angel. Then in a twinkling, I heard in the street the prancing and pawing of small ones, little feet. He's gentle and kind. So to every Andy, Susie, and Steve, watch Toy Story, the small one, and the preacher's wife, Christmas Eve, on Disney. Wednesday at 7, 6 Central. Hey, Movie Surfers, it's Tina. Today we're peeking behind the scenes of Disney's new comedy, Mr. Magoo, based on the famous cartoon character. Magoo? I love that cartoon. Who's playing him? Leslie Nielsen. In the movie, he witnesses the world's worst jewel heist and ends up with a priceless ruby. <laughs> Was it tough turning the cartoon into live action? To find out how they transformed Mr. Magoo, click the Focus On icon. I want you to put some water on the boil and lift both legs high into the air. <laughs> Magoo is a very happy man, and uh, he would prefer to find some way to laugh and to be generous and jovial than to be uh, serious and desperate. So I find it's easier to pep it up and say, ah, <laughs> no, well, yes. Just like the cartoon, Mr. Magoo finds himself in some close calls. To the eggplant mobile! I thought it would be funny to have Magoo get involved in some dire daredevil stunt stuff. I'm skiing down the mountain on the inverted ironing board. <laughs> but the whole production has unusual action sequences. So that's our focus on Mr. Magoo, coming to theaters December 25th. Yes! <laughs> While you're waiting for that jolly old guy in the bright red suit to come down your chimney, we just wanted to say Merry Christmas from Disney. Stay tuned. Growing Pains will be right back. Tonight at 6.30, 5.30 Central on a never-before-seen Muppets Tonight. What would you expect from a greatest hit show? Big stars, unforgettable performances. She switches the brights up. We share and And, of course, plenty of hits. Don't miss Muppets Tonight's greatest hits. Tonight at 6.30, 5.30 Central on Disney. That was surprisingly good. Welcome to Magical World of Animals. Would you like to try our creature combo on Sunday nights, going well with Jeff Carwin and Umba Macamba? I will set aside my hunger and focus on what I do best, giving animal information to the world. Well, in that case, first whet your appetite for the wild with a supersized serving of Jeff Carwin. I think it needs some cocktail sauce, though. Then, still hungry for more? Pig out with Macamba. I'm going to starve. Hold the pickles, hold the lettuce. Just don't hold this. <laughs> Only joking. You'll eat it up tonight at 7 p.m. 6 Central. This is delicious. Tuesday on Magical World of Disney. We've got three holiday shows asking, what's that special thing you're wishing for? I don't know. Well, how about a plush toy animal? You even get to name it yourself. This is Velma the Magnificent. Well, whether you wish for something that speeds by, flies away, or maybe as a surprise, remember who can make it all happen. First, there's... Santa Claus. And then there's Disney, making your holiday wishes come true with the Teddy Bear's Christmas. The bestest present? And it nearly wasn't Christmas. Tuesday on Disney. Movies at 7, 6 Central. Here's a special holiday greeting from Disney. How do you celebrate the holidays? Our family celebrates Kwanzaa. For seven days, we light a candle. 
Each candle represents a principle. Like unity and self-determination. My family is from the Philippines. Where did this one go? For New Year, Mom puts out 12 kinds of fruit, one for each month. It will bring abundance all year long. Happy Holidays from Disney! We now return to Growing Pains, right here on Disney. Stay tuned. Growing Pains will be right back. Come on, everybody. You gotta watch us now. Wanna see action? April V, outside one of Disney's recording studios, where some of the most famous Disney characters mm. get a voice. Inside, mm. they're working on a new movie called Beauty and the Beast, The Enchanted Christmas. It's a story about the Beauty and the Beast characters celebrating a magical Christmas. Let's meet the real life voice of Belle, Paige O'Hara. Well, what exactly do you do in here? Well, I go through my script, I make my choices, and in animation, they actually put the voices down first, and the animators will videotape us sometimes, but they'd actually draw the characters after we do the voices. But today, it's a little different. We're looping. What's looping? I have to match Belle's image here on the screen. I have to do the voice, and it's going to have to match her exactly. Greg, roll it. Okay. What's Christmas? Oh, Chip, you must know about Christmas. Stockings in front of the fire, tree, tinsel. Wow, can I try? Sure. Bell, what's Christmas? Oh, Chip, you must know about Christmas. Stockings in front of the fire, tree, tinsel, presents. Presents? <laughs> you were perfect. Uh, thanks. <laughs> that was fun. Isn't it fun? Coming out on video only this holiday season, don't miss Paige O'Hara as the voice of Belle. Absolutely. In a brand new movie, Beauty and the Beast, The Enchanted Christmas. We now return to Growing Pains, right here on Disney. Mike. Coming up next, it's Growing Pains. Then Rizzo and Gonzo host the best of Muppets tonight. Season's greetings from Disney. Everybody, I've got some really big news. Wow, look at the view from up here. Uh, Gonzo, I'm trying to make an announcement down here. Oh, uh, sorry, Kermit. Uh, we've got some brand new episodes of Muppets Tonight. Hey, look what I found. There's enough cheese back here to keep me fat and happy till next year. Uh, and every week we're going to have some really big stars like Martin Short, Coolio, gotta, gotta get up to get down. and Sandra Bullock. This is so cool. And you can see our show every weekend right here. Hey, what is this place? Well, that's what I've been trying to tell you. Muppets Tonight, tonight at 6.30, 5.30 Central, only on Disney. Huh, I'm staying here as long as the food holds out. <laughs> and now it's time for a Toy Story treat. Okay, steering contest, go! Toy Story, Wednesday at 7, 6 central on Disney. Whoa, whoa, on Disney, we got lots of crazy Disney shows, mo' better, don't you know the Wacky Man? New shows, doobie doo shows, with lots of nutty daddy -os. we got heartthrobs gonna rob your heartthrobs. Plus those kooky tunes, crazy loons, tumble on and boom, oh look out, cause Aladdin's gonna get you. Hear me talking now, Disney, you can't go wrong now, with all those crazy, wacky, oh so snappy shows. With Disney variety, the spice of life, man. Thank you very much. You're beautiful. Stay tuned. Growing Pains will be right back. 
tonight at 6.30, 5.30 Central on a never-before-seen Muppets Tonight. What would you expect from a greatest hit show? Big stars, unforgettable performances. She switches the brights up. We share our And, of course, plenty of hits. Muppets Tonight's Greatest Hits, tonight at 6.30, 5.30 Central on Disney. That was surprisingly good. Sunday night's Magical World of Disney becomes Disney's Magical World of Animals. And if you don't believe me, Umba Macumba. Is that Swahili for Ask Macumba? It's also the name of a show. Do not be confused by its name. This know-it-all really does know-it-all, at least when it comes to animals. Macumba never tires of unlocking the vaults of wisdom and sharing his intellectual riches with the world. Go inside the mind of Africa's Animal Answer Man and also get to see some really cool animals do some really cool stuff. Be there tonight at 7.30, 6.30 Central on Disney. Thank you for calling. Want to spend some time with a typical American family? Meet the Sinclairs every afternoon on Disney. Okay, so they're dinosaurs. That doesn't stop me from having a flagrantly uninformed opinion. But Dad still goes to work each day. Sinclair, in here now! Mom watches the baby. I can do it! I can do it! You just never know what to expect with this family. Your folks never have mammals over for dinner? All the time! They're yummy! So if you're hungry for more, watch Dinosaurs every day at 5 p.m. 4 Central on Disney. Tomorrow night on Magical World of Disney, two shows with Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer. I can't believe it! What I can't believe is why they call him a reindeer. It's not like he's a deer of the rain. If anything, he should be a snow deer, right? Like in Rudolph's Shiny New Year. Stop this tyranny at once! No, I'm serious. Why a reindeer? Unless it's because he's at the end of Santa's reign, like in Rudolph and Frosty Christmas in July. Oh, come on. He's such a cute one, isn't he? Hey, that must be where they get the second part of Reindeer. You know, because he's so dear. Oh, dear. Tomorrow night on Disney. Movies at 7, 6 Central. We now return to Growing Pains, right here on Disney. Okay. Stay tuned. Growing Pains will be right back. Tuesday on Magical World of Disney. We've got three holiday shows asking, what's that special thing you're wishing for? I don't know. Well, how about a plush toy animal? You even get to name it yourself. This is Velma the Magnificent. Well, whether you wish for something that speeds by, flies away, or maybe as a surprise, remember who can make it all happen. First, there's... Santa Claus. And then there's Disney, making your holiday wishes come true with the Teddy Bear's Christmas. The bestest present, and it nearly wasn't Christmas. Tuesday on Disney, movies at 7, 6 Central. Hey guys, it's Matt from the Movie Surfers here on Disney. Guess what? Tina went to the premiere of the new Disney comedy Flubber starring Robin Williams. Why don't we take a snapshot look at the big event? Tom, click the icon. Surfers, can you believe it? This is such a scene. Green carpet, test tubes, tons of fans. And look at these lights. And of course, Robin Williams. Robin's making too much noise over there! Please! So I understand that you had to mime and act like you had Flubber in your hands. How did you do that? You basically have to create this character and, you know, give it depth and height. And then, along with that, give it a personality. Describe it. And that's how, that's how you create it. What was it like bouncing around on the set? Fun. Oh, yes! What did you have to do? Well, basically, you get to fly as bungee cords and you wear this incredibly tight pants. <laughs> <laughs> what was it like working with someone like Robin Williams? You can tell what it's like working with Robin Williams. It's so unpredictable as lover. <laughs> After the movie, it was time for the cast and crew to celebrate. Here's my pass for the party. Let's go. They made the party look just like the gym in the movie. Pretty gross, huh? Let's try the flubber talk. And that's our snapshot look at Flubber's premiere. You can check out Flubber yourself, now playing in theaters. See ya, surfers. We now return to Growing Pains, right here on Disney. Tonight on Disney, Rizzo hosts the never-before-seen best-of episode of Muppets Tonight. Then, what will Jeff uncover this week on Going Wild with Jeff Corwin? Later... Have an animal question? Better Umba Macumba. That's Swahili for Ask Macumba. It's all coming up tonight, right here on Disney. And now a few words from Disney. What should I want? Laugh. Explore. I believe in me. Sing. Oh. Play. 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 Dance. You're a dancing fool, man. What I'm talking? Look at that. Perform. Oh, 
question. Uh, rap? Experience. Let's go surfing. Okay, now try it at home. Laugh, explore, sing, play, dance on Disney. Tomorrow night on Magical World of Disney, two shows with Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer. I can't believe it! What I can't believe is why they call him a reindeer. It's not like he's a deer of the rain. If anything, he should be a snow deer, right? Like in Rudolph's Shiny New Year. Stop this tyranny at once! No, I'm serious. Why a reindeer? Unless it's because he's at the end of Santa's reigns, like in Rudolph and Frosty Christmas in July. Oh, come on. He's such a cute one, isn't he? Hey, that must be where they get the second part of reindeer. You know, because he's so dear. Oh, dear. Tomorrow night on Disney. Movies at 7, 6 Central. Oh, hi. Welcome to the Magic Shop. You know, we get a lot of tourists here at the Magic Shop, so we get a lot of foreign money, like this coin from China. Sometimes we get coins from Europe, like this British penny, but the boss likes it better when I change all of the coins into American coins, like this one. I'd like to show you a coin trick right now that you can do with any coin, but I'm going to go ahead and use the good old American quarter. This is the one you've been dropping in the video games lately. Here's what you do with it. Watch as I rub the coin into my elbow, and finally, whoops, well, you need to do it a little bit better than that. I mean, I'm going to rub the coin into my elbow, and finally, it vanishes completely. Would you like to learn how to do that? First, I need to get the quarter back. And I do mean quarter back. That's where it ends up, and here is how it got there. The first time you do this, you really rub the coin on your elbow, just like this. Then you pretend to drop it. How very clumsy of me, you say. Grab the quarter with your left hand, pretend to take it with your right hand, but you don't really take it. It stays in your left hand the whole time. The secret here is to keep looking at your right hand. Your friends will always look wherever you're looking. So you keep looking at your right hand as it goes down to your elbow and pretends to rub the coin into the back of the elbow. Secretly place the quarter on the back of your neck. The coin finally vanishes completely, and your friends will say, hey, Where'd the quarter go? You say, I don't know. Actually, I've never really figured that part out. But I will trade you for this one right up here. That's it for today. I'll see you next time right here at the Magic Shop. We're trimming the trees, decking the halls, and lighting the lights to wish you and your whole family a very Merry Christmas. Don't go away. Muppets Tonight will be right back. Sunday night's Magical World of Disney becomes Disney's Magical World of Animals. And if you don't believe me, Umba Macumba. Is that Swahili for Ask Macumba? It's also the name of a show. Do not be confused by its name. This know-it-all really does know-it-all, at least when it comes to animals. Macumba never tires of unlocking the vaults of wisdom and sharing his intellectual riches with the world. Go inside the mind of Africa's Animal Answer Man and also get to see some really cool animals do some really cool stuff. Be there tonight at 7 36 30 Central on Disney. Thank you for calling. Disney's got a show that shows you about brotherly love. Oh, look at that! Brothers should get together for quiet dinners at home. Brothers should help out around the house. Look at that, it's messy again. Hold up. Oh my gosh, it's clean. Brothers should find activities to do together. You have me cleaning the shower on Saturday morning. Fungus doesn't sleep in on weekends, Joe. Or weekdays either, for that matter, because the brothers are on brotherly love. We're here to have fun. Every weekday at 6, 35, 30 Central, only on Disney. Disney celebrates family. There's something for you and something for me. It's a wonderful, magical place to be, where we can live in harmony. It's an open invitation for your imagination. Go out and explore our magical world. It's a time for celebration and instant vacation, the place where dreams can be unfurled. Disney celebrates family with something for you and something for me. It's a wonderful, magical place to be where we can live in harmony. Wednesday on Magical World of Disney. Wow. Twas the night before Christmas and all through the place, every toy was stirring, even the one with a movable face. Look, I'm Picasso. The family was gathered by the tree with care in hopes that Denzel soon would be there. I'm an angel. Then in a twinkling, I heard in the street the prancing and pawing of small ones, little feet. He's gentle and kind. So to every Andy, Susie, and Steve, watch Toy Story, The Small One, and The Preacher's Wife, Christmas Eve on Disney, Wednesday at 7, 6 Central. 
And now back to Muppets Tonight, right here on Disney. Don't go away. Muppets Tonight will be right back. Sunday night's magical world of Disney becomes Disney's magical world of animals. And one such animal is so rare it can only be seen on Disney. <laughs> We're talking about a mammal known as a Jeff Corwin. Its scientific name is Ambistoma tigranum. This Corwin creature habitats a Disney Channel environment called Going Wild with Jeff Corwin. Every week he goes wild into the wild, seeking to find and understand other animals. There's something right there moving around. Join an actual Jeff Corwin on his daring journeys. Tonight at 7, 6 central on Disney. Hey, folks! Feeling blocked, befuddled, confused? Well, now Disney's got the cure for what ails you. Disney's got pow, zip, bang, boom, pop, and the boss included at no extra charge. Yeah, Disney, you'll find young stars, hot cars, giant McDonald's, babes and their sitters, big brothers, magic genies, meanies, and more, much, much more. Plus, if you watch now, you'll see at no extra charge. More stuff to numerous to mention. Turn on Disney, we got the cure for what ails you. But just now, holy cow, the time is now on Disney! Tuesday on Magical World of Disney. We've got three holiday shows asking, what's that special thing you're wishing for? I don't know. Well, how about a plush toy animal? You even get to name it yourself. This is Velma the Magnificent. Well, whether you wish for something that speeds by, flies away, or maybe is a surprise, remember who can make it all happen. First, there's... Santa Claus. And then there's Disney, making your holiday wishes come true with the Teddy Bear's Christmas. The bestest present, and it nearly wasn't Christmas. Tuesday on Disney, movies at 7, 6 Central. Here's a special holiday greeting from Disney. How do you celebrate the holidays? We're, we're the, the Finleys. And, and we're, we're the Kellys. Kellys. And, and we, we have double the fun for the holidays. We always make latkes on Hanukkah. They are potato pancakes with apple sauce. Every year, my mom makes our Christmas cards. She uses these stamps. And this is how I make the card. Happy, Happy holidays from Disney. And now back to Muppets Tonight, right here on Disney. Well, if you haven't guessed by now. Next Sunday on a never-before-seen Muppets Tonight, can the Muppets tell the world's funniest joke? Who was that lady I saw you with last night? Oh, I didn't go out last night. I, I stayed home and watched wrestling. No, 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 no. Who was that lady I saw you with last night? But I wasn't with a lady. I was watching wrestling with a boy. <laughs> Again with the wrestling? Find out on a never-before-seen Muppets Tonight. Who was that lady I saw you with last night? No, 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 don't you remember, Pepe? Last night we went to Bobo's to watch wrestling. Next Sunday at 6, 35, 30 Central on Disney. If you think Muppets Tonight is strange... And of course they do. Then wait till you see what's coming up next. It's all about animals. Oh, 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 are there rats? You'll have to watch and find out. Alrighty then. They call me weird. Tonight on Disney. Find out what Jeff uncovers this week on Going Wild with Jeff Corwin. Then, he's the know-it-all of the animal kingdom. Stay tuned for Umba Macomba. Later, they sing, they dance, they even eat bugs. They're Timon and Pumbaa. It's all coming up tonight, right here on Disney. Come on, everybody, you gotta watch us now. Wanna see action? Tomorrow night on Magical World of Disney, two shows with Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer. I can't believe it! What I can't believe is why they call him a reindeer. It's not like he's a deer of the rain. If anything, he should be a snow deer, right? Like in Rudolph's Shiny New Year. Stop this tyranny at once! No, I'm serious. Why a reindeer? Unless it's because he's at the end of Santa's reigns, like in Rudolph and Frosty Christmas in July. Oh, come on. He's such a cute one, isn't he? Hey, that must be where they get the second part of reindeer. You know, because he's so dear. Oh, dear. Tomorrow night on Disney. Movies at 7, 6 Central. The holiday season means different things to different people. But no matter how you celebrate the season, happy holidays from Disney.